What up? It's your boy Sean here. Now listen, I got my own thoughts on Google Stadia or Stadia, whatever you want to call it. So let's get into it. When Google announced that they were doing Google Stadia, I and many others were like surprised that a major company like Google decided to create their own system. Now, obviously, they're not going to get any um, support from Microsoft, Sony, or Nintendo because they have their own. Nintendo with the Switch and the it's a U.S. accessory to the 3DS, Sony with the upcoming PS5, and Microsoft with the Xbox One. So let's dive into a little bit of the, you know, Google Stadia stuff. For instance, it looks pretty good. But, uh, a couple things I have with it is, I think it's trying to copy... Xbox a little bit. Or at least the controller-wise. It's like... But, I mean... The, yeah, and they have, like, all these cords and stuff. And the big, you know, TV. Or big screen. Um, yeah. It also has no YouTube on it. So, what the heck? Now. When it was announced... Like I said, many people and I were, like, surprised that Google would take its dips into the video game industry. Now, besides Nintendo, Sony, and Microsoft, they can obviously, you know, work with Google. I was thinking, possibly, the following. Capcom, Square Enix, Activision, probably Activision, if I know my stuff. Um, Vivendi Games, uh, THQ Nordic, um, I'm trying to think of some other stuff, 505 Games, like, smaller companies, like, small, like, indie titles, I know Nintendo's got a lot of indie games, <laughs> they're called Nindies, Discord, I think, is one. I know it's an app for communicating. In fact, I have my own that you can find in the link in the description. But let's get back to the sync. Yeah, um, Google Stadia, when it launches in November of this year, I and many others will be like, hmm? Are they really going to do a good job or are they going to fail? That's just a, we'll have to wait and see. But also, I'm worried I'll be more like Sega. If you guys do not know, Sega had, um, their own gaming systems. They had the Sega Master System, Sega Genesis, which I have the flashback version in my room. Um, they had the, uh, Saturn and the Dreamcast. But after Sonic Adventure 2 in 2001, they said, you know what, we're going to focus on third-party development. So that's what I'm thinking Google Stadia might lead to. I could be wrong, but that's just a, we'll see kind of view. We'll see if it's going to work, is it going to fail? All these questions will be answered in November. So yeah, that is my like official reviewed on Google Stadia. I'll be doing reviews for like other systems. Like if there's any new ones coming out, like possibly this this is for 3DS. Um the upcoming PS5. And just all that jazz. For now. Please click here to watch the recommended video. Subscribe to me. I'll see you later.